Hello everyone and welcome to the campaign of Sargon of Akkad. We will play the final scenario, the fifth scenario, Subartu, on hard difficulty. After another beautiful campaign designed by the Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition team, we will finish the campaign, the last campaign that we were playing together um, for the return of Rome, and it will be the fifth scenario, Subartu, on hard difficulty. Let's do it. Blood, sweat, tears, and the stench of burning bodies accompanied us on our way east. And it was not long before my fears came true. Barely had we crossed into the kingdom of Subartu when our people took up arms in rebellion. After years of grandiose campaigns, they were sick of the exorbitant taxes that Sargon levied to fund his wars. When I shared the bad news with Sargon, I hoped that he would see reason and accept that he had taken things too far. But the hateful glare in his eyes suggested the opposite. Whoa, that was a short cinematic. Main objectives, wait for instruction. Sargon has a power population limit of 100. We are already on the Iron Age. You do not have to completely destroy your enemies. Focus on taking and holding megalithic structures, ruins instead. Ruins conquered by allied factions count as yours. Sumerian rebels dissatisfied with Sargon's rule have captured some settlements and should be dealt with. The Hurrians are less enthusiastic about providing military aid to the Akkadians. Time will tell how trustworthy they really are. So now we have trouble with our allies, and we have to survive, apparently. <laughs> uh, Sargon One Blue has assembled a large army for the invasion of Subartu. This time he has numerous villagers and enough resources to start build a camp. Subartu to Red lies to the east and is defended by archers, cavalry, and towers. The Urians Three Scion formerly only contributed financially to Sargon's campaign, but have now been conscripted into military service. They will permanently deploy catapults, camel riders, and chariots. Sumerian rebels for the have occupied several villages, 6th Ray. That had all sworn loyal to Sargon. The rebel forces consist of swordmen, chariot archers, and ballistas. If the Cadians manage to retake the aforementioned villages, they will pass Sumerian allies, 5 Orange, who support Sargon's cause. Rumor has it that Sutean desert nomads have green grown to northeast. Perhaps Sargon can lie himself with these hordes of horse archers. Let's find out. Um, yeah, that's a lot of friends to play with. <laughs> A lot of players in this game as well. Um, a new wow. era dawns. Conquer the monuments of the past and carve my name on them. The name of your god, Sargon. We will follow you, your majesty, uh, your divinity. We have captured a monolith. Having to bring your divinity bad news. The soldiers from our very own ranks are revolting and have taken control of some villages. We have captured a monolith. Ombus. 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 Ombus.
on this. Oklahoma, on this. Logan, Oklahoma. All right. Yeah, um, many things to pay attention because apparently they might betray me. Uh, I would just leave it on scout. I don't know if he's already dead, but oh yeah, he's about to be dead. It's still good. Got plenty of information. Probably will need to pen up a lot of enemies and they are using a lot of camels. So maybe I can go back, uh, go after 10 with ooh, a lot of houses. Very good. I need that. So far, they're doing good. Like I was using with the Macedonian thing. Apparently, the there's always the camo, so it should be easy. Oh, no. 
This village will no longer cause us any difficulties and will stand by our side faithfully again. Well, let's get to know. is ours again. In gratitude, its residents kneel in the dust to pay homage to Sargon. will no longer cause us any difficulties and will stand by our side faithfully again. Oh, Sargon, we have been wandering the desert for weeks and have run out of food and water. Feed us and we will make you our lord. Enough of this megalomania! We will no longer accept your self deification, Sargon, as you bring great misfortune upon us. You little profane fools! Soldiers, slay the wicked Hurrians who dare to sully the name of their god! Okay, now I want to capture the last two villages. Rogan? Columbus. Columbus. Hilari? Alamas. Columbus. Alright. Okay, okay. Mm. Need some camels to ride there. He has this place for me. All 
right conscription. I need to get used to this new tech. Much better. And I also need to probably pacify the Hurrians. And they did the betrayal. They were promising me in the objective section. Yuri, Better units. Some of the monoliths. Another village is ours again. In gratitude, its residents kneel in the dust to pay homage to Sargon. Let's go to the last one. Bombus, Bombus, The rebels come are defeated. Their unwillingness to accept their fate. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. Mighty Sargon, we beg you, hear us, save us from our distress. Yeah, I'll tribute to you guys. Now I need to help with my companions, the Hurrians. We will never forget your mercy, Sargon. Anyone who besmirches your name will be held accountable by us. We have captured a monolith. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. You 
game's got a lot of stuff. Uh, we need to develop a part of We have vehicles. captured a monolith. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. Okama. Tarai. Able Dada. Able Dada. Abadactus. Rockfish. Abadactus. Rockfish. Erectus. Abadactus. We have captured a monolith. This is what will happen to anyone who dares oppose Sargon's word and will. We have captured a monolith. Yeah, keep doing it. But their tributes are being raised. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
We have lost control of some of the monoliths. Let me you guys take care. We have captured a monolith. Arai. Could help me, maybe, just maybe. Is there any way to direct their attack? Definitely not. Hilari. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. We have captured a monolith. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. We have captured a monolith. We have lost control of some of the monoliths. We have captured a monolith.
lost control of some of the monoliths. the monolith. We have captured a monolith. We have lost control of some of the monolith. some of the monoliths. Oh, we have captured a monolith. Control of some of the monoliths. We have captured a monolith.
get a monolith. What's that Sumerian secret? <laughs> that was a crazy kind of boy. of some of the monoliths. Alamas, Alamas,
We have lost control of some of the monoliths. We have captured a monolith. Left for red. Alamas. 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 Captured a monolith. Mesopotamia is not enough. The divine realm of Sargon will continue to grow. I shall walk the ruins of Sabartu, and its people will kneel before me. JG folks, and it should be unlocked the god of war. Can a mortal being of flesh and blood become a god? The answer is no. No matter how much power a man attains, anyone who towers too far above others is doomed to fall in the end. Sargon was the king of kings, the most powerful man that had ever walked the earth. His empire, the first that mankind had ever seen. In the temples, Sargon had replaced the statues of the gods with statues of himself. And now, truly believed that he was divine. Yet I had seen him bleed. I sought him out after the sack of Subartu, only to find him standing atop a mountain of gold and corpses, precious stones passing through his fingers. He did not listen when I told him that this madness had to end. Once, I left my sword in its scabbard to spare the man who would be my king. But things were different this time. This was no man standing in front of me. No deity. It was an evil demon from the underworld, striding the earth to claim the souls of the innocent. I then remembered the prophetic words. The blood of the innocent will be paid for by the blood of the one. I plunged my blade deep into Sargon's chest. As he stared at me with wide eyes, a strange, wicked smile appeared on his face. Even in the face of death, Sargon never ceased believing in his own immortality. I have no such delusions. As old age withers my once supple frame, I welcome the journey to the afterlife, 
satisfied that no more innocent blood will be spilled in the name of this false god. Yet, I fear Sargon's legacy. The vices of power and a desire for divinity can inspire grim changes in even the most noble of men. I can only pray that for every haughty Sargon, there will be a humble Ushar, guided not by delusions of grandeur, but by a simple conscience of what is right and what is wrong. Ooh, that was a scary ending. The death of Sargon. Okay, that was a lot of killed units. That was cute, that ratio, pretty good. Not the many lost buildings. Thought I would lose a lot more. As far as I just tried, even though I did not win, thought that we would finish the scenario. You need to catch the relic, the ruins for you. As always, a lot of uh, tributes sent me. As for technology, maps, that was pretty great. Samara Rebels got the most research. Also got a uh, village account and great, even a uh, wonder destruction. Beautiful map, beautiful scenario, and that was a great way of ending the campaign. So that was it. I had already showed most of the map through the play. I hope that you, all of you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like my content, please like and subscribe, and I see you next time.